Morning, good afternoon, good evening guys, welcome to Crystal V Talking, the only K-pop reaction channel on the whole of YouTube. Because, facts, welcome to a brand new video. This is going to be something a little different. <laughs> Why am I doing this? Like I'm going crazy. <laughs> it's going to be something a little different. Uh, basically, I was just thinking to myself, you know what? I've done me quite a few K-pop reactions, quite a, <laughs> quite a few K-pop videos. Um, um. I'm fully aware that my memory is probably one of the worst out there because half or quarter of my brain is trying to remember fucking manhwa names and the other quarter is trying to remember anime character names and the other quarter is trying to remember fucking manga names and the other quarter is trying to remember my colleagues names so it's quite hard to remember everything <laughs> every day or am I giving myself excuses? Probably so. So um, but yeah, so basically I thought some stuff, hey, let me just test myself and see if I can remember as many uh, fandom names as possible, K-pop fandom names as possible. Uh, I know that I'm probably going to fail, but as I am the only K-pop channel on the whole of YouTube because of facts, I have to make sure that I'm giving you guys the content that you guys are not asking for. I don't know where I'm going with this. Uh, um, yeah, I'm going to leave a link down below to this and obviously I'm going to fail. So after I do the the, the game thing, I'm also going to go through and see, uh, I'll go through a list and see the different names and kind of read them out and try to get it stuck in my head so I can remember for the future. So if you guys enjoyed this video, do hit a thumbs up. If you want other reactions or videos like this as well, then do let me know down below in the comment section. I want to just have a bit more fun on my channel, whether it's not just doing the reactions, but also doing some dancing, doing this kind of stuff. You know, we've got to keep you guys entertained and I want to make sure that I'm not just necessarily doing the same thing all the time. If you do want regular reactions, I will be making sure that I do at least two videos a week where it might be like a bulk reaction instead like I used to do like a my end of week and we just catch up with all the requests in one video you know it'll be a bit easier for myself instead of doing 100 videos going nowhere so we do it into one or two videos and during a week I do more videos like this more dance practice uh, reactions as well as more dance freestyles and even checking out some dance videos as well so we're gonna just play around have some fun remember I'm doing this for fun and hopefully you guys enjoy the content I mean 40,000 of you you guys have subscribed I, don't, I, I have no idea why but hey it is what it is so um unfortunately this is from a freaking BuzzFeed. So wait, one second. Pow! Oh, there we are. Okay. So, this was on a BuzzFeed. Um, so, ah, I'm hoping that this gives me somewhat of a fucking advantage. But let's get into this. Apparently it says here, only a real K-pop stan can identify these groups from only their fandom name. At me, bro. Freaking at me. Okay, so uh, we're gonna just go through and see what it's saying. Duh, 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 duh. So, where is it? Right, so, the first one, obviously, the army is BTS. Do I type it? BTS, boy. Guess. Of course, of course, of course, of course. I don't live under a rock. But I might have to name my house a rock because sometimes I feel like I am. Blink. <laughs> oh man, oh, I need help. All right, so obviously, black, pink in your area. Okay, are they gonna are they gonna fuck me up if I put black than pink, or is it black pink? I'm gonna put black pink. Of course, of course, of course, of course, of course. Who remembers uh, when I used to be a major Jenny stan at the very beginning of my reactions, and now I'm definitely leaning towards. Jisoo or Rose? Yeah. Maybe Lisa. Maybe Jenny. I don't know. We're going to go through. Once. Okay, so if it's once, it's got to be twice. Oh, 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 of course, of course, of course. This is too easy. This is way too easy. Come on, come on. Test me. I got to say. Or should we say, I got seven? <laughs> no, I got, got seven. Okay. So, boom, once again, got seven. We are flying through. These are the ones where it's like, uh, okay, Sone. This is, this is it. This is where things start being a little bit tricky. This is where things start being a little bit tricky. Sone, 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 Sone. 
Oh uh, shit. I I don't know. So no. Uh, I don't I don't know. I'm gonna put N A for not available. Guess. I don't know. Oh fuck it, I give up. Who is it? Girls Generation. Ah. Uh, I haven't done enough Girls Generation's reactions. I think I've probably done one or two, so I don't feel too too bad. Shay Wells. He would be so angry at me if I got this wrong. If I got this wrong. Am I some form of waste man? Of course I'm not. We are going to move on. Let's switch up the music to the opening music because I don't have many songs <laughs> lined up. Okay, Universe. Fuck, I know this one. I know this one, I'm gonna kick myself. Oh. Universe, 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 universe. The moon, I'm gonna, something to do with moon. Something to do with, fuck. Oh no, I'm really gonna kick myself. All right, five, four. Hmm, ah, oh, fuck it. Oh no, 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 I don't wanna give up. I don't wanna give up, I don't wanna give up. Um. Oh man, oh man, I fucking give up. Pentagon. I wasn't even gonna say Pentagon, I'm not gonna lie to you. I was not gonna say Pentagon, so I learned something new today. I learned something new today. Carrot. Where's my ting? Where is my ting? Because, uh, Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? My little money box. Do you think, do you think my boys, I don't know if you can see, do you think my boys would be would be happy about me not knowing the fandom name. <laughs> of course, put goddamn 17 of these bad boys. F fucking of course, look at this. And then we get a snippet of them dancing. Of course, Starlight. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Vix. Okay. Okay. See, I don't feel too bad because once again, I haven't done many Vix reactions. Maybe three out of 500 videos on here. So that says a lot. Mom, baby. <sighs> Guys. 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 Of course it's Monster X. What the hell? <laughs> Who remembers when I used to say Monster Tar X? <laughs> Eighteeny. You guys need to stop a teasing me. <laughs> uh, man, what's wrong with me? Of course it's correct. Okay, Moa. Let me just send a TXT to my friend. Oh, we are fucking... But is it t.x.t or is it txt? This is where... I'm going to put txt. Kind of like Hunter Hunter. Yep. Well, so then it's txt. I'm glad it didn't just say wrong straight away. Oh, they wanted me to write. I'm like, hey, I got it right. I got it right. <laughs> Look at these. <laughs> Look at these boys. Look at these boys. Uh, Rev. I want to say Red Velvet here, but I feel like that's way too close. But I'm going to put it because I have no fucking idea. Red Velvet. You gotta think smart, not hard. Wait, think hard, not smart. I oh, don't know. Mitzi. Sounds like Itzy. See, some of these ones, yeah. No? What? 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 It's Mitzi. Is it not Itzy? Is it Itzy? Oh! Here's me thinking. Like, I know what I'm doing. Elvis. The Elvis, 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 Presley, Elvis, I don't know, couldn't tell you, couldn't tell you, A-O-A, -A. drop down, make it hot, alright, moving on, inner circle, alright, you guys are just fucking making up names now, you just, what could be an inner circle? What could be an inner circle? If 
feel like this is this this I don't know. I give up. What is it? Winner. Okay. Inner. Winner. Winner circle. Inner circle. Uh, fix. Vix was already up earlier, wasn't it? Can they have two fandom names? <laughs> That was a really awkward laugh. That was the laugh of a man who knows he's fucked up. Six fuck's sake. Look at him. Look at him, the boss at the front. Ah! Moo Moo. Oh, of course. Of course. Ma, ma, moo. That. Mmm. Mmm. Gotta love the ladies. Uh, Neverland. Neverland. Ah, oh, fuck. Neverland. I'm gonna be pissed off. Neverland. Who who else is like me when when you don't know something you just repeat it and hope for the very fucking best that you fucking get to it. I don't know where is it. Neverland. G idol. Ah, oh, man. How am I such a waste, man? Stay. When they gave me the fucking biggest video on my channel, <laughs> it would be it would be foolish for me not to not to know. Stray kids. I got thirteen out of twenty. You scored better than forty-six of all other quiz takers. Pretty good. Good effort. You clearly know quite a bit about K-pop. No, I don't. No, I don't. I was shit. There was two hit. You know what? Two of those I should have got. So it should have been 15 out of 20. Then I would have been happy because that would have been 100% for me. But yeah. That was that. Do let me know what you guys got. I'd love to know what you guys got. Um, and I feel like that was a quite an easy one. So I know. Chris, do a harder quiz. Do a harder quiz if you're the only K-pop reaction channel on the whole of YouTube because of facts. There was no way to get the, the graphic. Then you should know every single K-pop idol group name, fandom name. Let me tell you something. I don't know my housemates' names, okay? So we're just going to move on with that. Okay, so I'm going to leave that uh, in the description down below. 13 out of 20. For me, that's 80% because I only expected 15. Uh, so yeah, I did better than I expected. Let me know what you guys got down below in the comment section. Uh, let's just go to K-pop fandom names and then see the list. Nope. Okay. So this is EliteDaily.com. The meaning behind your fave. Just write favorite, man. I mean, you're already halfway there. K-pop group fans, groups, fandom names are so deep. So deep. Tell me, Michelle, or Michelle, Michelle Mendez, why are they so deep? Am I going to read this? Oh. All right, let's read this. Okay, so with so many K-pop groups and singers in the world, it's important for fans to distinguish themselves from other supporters in order to show everyone what specific community they belong in. For example, they can wear merchandise exclusive to one artist to show their dedication, or they can rep their faves. Fucking right favorite <laughs> signature light stick at a show. But below all of that, the first thing a fandom needs is a title because it's the most basic way of showing one's loyalty, of course. The list of K-pop groups fandom names shows all the biggest artists have a nickname they call their followers, and they're always packed with so much underlying meaning. Okay, see, I want to have an underlying meaning. I have like names for my uh, patron tiers with the pop tarts and the popcorns. I thought at some point in my uh, in my little YouTube career, I'd be like, "Hey, it would be funny if you put a K in front of popcorn. It says K popcorn." If you put a K in front of Pop Tart, it says K Pop Tart. So, <laughs> big brain energy, 1000 IQ. So then that was, that's the, that. I don't have one for, for this YouTube. So, maybe when I get to like 500,000 subscribers, I'll find something. I don't know. Anyways, uh, for you guys. So, da 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 da. Uh, as any K-pop lover can tell you, fandom names make fans feel so connected with each other. Oftentimes they're related to the artist's names or they can reference a special song by them. And knowing the backstory is like fans' little secrets that only others like them would know. Aha! 
There are so many UK pop artists with big followings, so it may be hard to remember every fandom name out there. That's where this little guide comes in. Whenever you find yourself joining a new fandom, keep this list bookmarked because it will give you a much needed intro to your community. <laughs> it sounded like um, Dave Chappelle winning. Unity! Anyways, BT1. BT1? BTS Army. Okay, BTS is short for Bangtan uh, Son Yeondan, which J Hope once explained means to be resistant to bullets. Ah! Society aims at adolescence, so it was only fitting the group named the Fandom Army, aka Adorable Representative MC for Youth. Okay, while appearing on The Tonight Show starring Jimmy Fallon, July Talk. Okay, that's a bit of information. RM revealed they also almost call their names the Bells because in Korean it sounds like Bang Wool, which is similar to the group name Bang Tan. Uh, thank God that it changed. Army's so much better, he said. Interesting. Two. Blackpink, Blink. I'm gonna f say it's not that creative with Blackpink. You're just gonna remove a few letters, put a few, few letters together and you've got the Blink, but you know, nice and memorable. This one is pretty self-explanatory. Blink is a combination of black and pink. Look at me, big brain energy over here. Moving on, 60 Moas, M-O-A, okay. A month after TXT debuted in March 2019, they revealed on April 25th their fandom would be called Young One, which is a play on the Korean word for forever. However, just days later on May 6th, they announced they would change it due to similarities with, uh, with another fandom name. That August, TXT finally announced their fans called uh, Moa, which stands for Moments of Alwaysness because they believe they, they, they will be with their fans. Okay, always and forever. Okay, thankfully things ended up working out because now fans can't imagine being called anything other than MOA. Four. Twice. Once. So many fucking numbers here. Okay, if you love us once, we will pay your love with twice of our love. That's big brain energy right there. Twice said of their fan name, adding once and twice to go together like needle on a thread. Okay, that was pretty fucking cool. Monster X, mon bébé. In French, it means my baby, but let's see what they say here. Monster X is one of the most endearing names for the fans. In French, mon bébé is the equivalent of my baby, my darling, my lover, or my soulmate. Yeah, for as much. <laughs> Six, one ho, win he, winnie. To officially kick off his solo career after his departure from Monster X in October 2019, Wano declared his fans as Winnie, which is short for We Are New. Oh, ending or We Need. 17, Carrots. Yo, we're going to go to 10 and then I'll leave a link down below so then uh, you guys can check out the rest for yourself. Carrots. Before 17's debut in 2015, they performed a song called Shining Diamond, so to honour the early days, they dubbed their fans Carrots, who helped them shine. Big boy energy. Guys, if you want some 17 content, you've got to let me know down below. I will bring back the 17 content. I'm going to make sure that, uh, what, what's the label called? What's the, what's the name of that label? Big Hits label changed. But yeah, they own some of 17's content. So when I was doing some of the reactions to 17, I started getting the videos totally blocked and I was worried that my, that my channel would get blocked. So I'm going to try and figure out how, well, I might start doing more Inside 17 and Going 17 because those shit are a lot of fun. Eight, got seven, I got seven. Seven is a lucky number and represents the number of members in the group, so I got seven means to be lucky to have each other. In Korea, the fandom name is shortened to Agase, which means a baby bird, as seen on the group's light stick. Aha, Red Velvet, Revel, Revelove, Revelove. As you may have guessed, Revelove is a combination of Red Velvet and Love. We chose it because we wanted the name to represent the loving relationship that Red Velvet has with all of you, so let's love each other and treasure each other for a really long time. The group explained in an April 2017 Instagram post about the name. And 10, NCT, N Citizen, which I think that's actually one of the best names for a fandom name, personally. But if you're here, N Citizen is a player of Citizen, so calling yourself an N Citizen means you're a loyal NCT. Okay, with Stray Kids being a Stay, let's just read this and then we'll pause it. <laughs> Apart from being a clever reference to the name, Stay also represents how Stray Kids always want to stay by their fans' sides. And I think that's a good place to leave it off there. But, guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, if you guys feel like you learned something, do let me know down below. If you want me to do uh, more reactions like this, let me know. Um, if you guys want, I was going to go longer, but I was like, I don't know if you guys actually want to watch 
more than 20 minutes it's been 20 minutes if you didn't fucking realize so if you guys do enjoy these kind of long videos do hit a thumbs up um okay let's just get this video to like eventually 300 likes if it gets to 300 likes then i'll do another kind of video like this uh i enjoyed this this is fun and it also helps me learn things because i'm not i feel like with reactions as well as much as i love giving my opinion and views on dancing or dance practices i want to learn as well so i do learn a lot from you guys in the comment sections but i also want to learn through articles or reading stuff or videos and stuff so feel free to let me know what sources i should use to get my information about k-pop and you guys have been absolutely awesome thank you so much for making it this far into the video i see you guys soon chris will be talking have a blessed day peace